let's start go to shared parameters new parameters type gravel cost under type parameter choose currency okay then okay then go to project parameters add shared parameters select uh, select gravel cost then okay choose type under identity data then check floors structural columns foundation framing then okay then okay then create global parameters to assign in our gra gravel cost parameter okay click new type gravel cost type of parameter currency under identity data okay and put cost um, apply okay and assign gravel cost from gro global parameter into all concrete component pick the foundation edit type check gravel cost pick pick gravel cost okay and okay pick columns and the type check gravel cost pick pick gravel cost okay okay then pick floor slabs edit type check gravel cost pick gravel cost okay okay then pick the beams and the type in gravel cost um, gravel cost okay okay create material takeoff under schedule quantities tab and okay select schedule material takeoff um, new construction okay the insert category type volume gravel cost uh, then we add calculated parameter and name it gravel quantity the unit for this is in cubic meter okay select the formula pick the volume uh, the formula is volume over 1 times 1 times 1.05 one cubic meter of concrete is equal to one cubic meter of gravel and the 1.05 is equal to additional 5% of quantity for wastage okay add calculated value and name it total cost good formula pick uh, gravel quantity 
times gravel cost okay then set up this the schedule and check blank row before data formatting alignment right calculate totals field format and check make it currency two decimal places and check use digit grouping gravel cost alignment right field format I think it's okay gravel quantity alignment right calculate totals field format check fix two decimal places use digit grouping material volume alignment is right things okay check check grand totals okay let's see the schedule okay now you have the schedule you have the category the type the volume and the gravel quantity required and the gravel cost and the total cost okay um, let's check the global parameters and let's try to revise the cost okay okay now you have it okay that's it